is Lady May my toes oval? Six bottles of alcohol and it's five of y'all. Yeah, you're definitely with some scammers. You know, things be moving when I walk, so. <laughs> Good afternoon! And welcome back to another vlog! Yeah, girl, it's back! What a, what a, what a, another vlog! What a, huh, another vlog! <laughs> hey, y'all, welcome back to another vlog! Today is Thursday. So, this is my third time. I'm so happy picking up the camera this week, y'all. But, Today, I don't know if I want to name this vlog Get Ready With Me Day Night or Maintenance Vlog or Maintenance Vlog slash Get Ready With Me Date Night. I don't know. But anyway, by the time you see the video, you'll see what I named it. But today, y'all, I got to go get my nails done because, baby, it's time for a feel and my nail broke right here. So I got to get my nails done and I got to get my feet done because them heels yeah they crusty so i'm gonna go to the nail shop that's not too far from me i would go to the like bougie one but honestly your girl ain't trying to pay a hundred and something dollars so the hood one well it ain't hood <laughs> let me not say the hood one the regular nail shop near me will be just fine and then later on tonight <laughs> We gonna date, girl. We gonna date. We gonna movie date. So I don't know if y'all have seen my Houston vlog when I first visited here back in April. I went to the rooftop movie theater here with Kita, and then I went again after that, probably like two weeks ago or like a week ago, probably been like a week. And I went to go see Poetic Justice. But today we going back there, but this time, baby, is with a date. <laughs> so I'm excited. We are gonna go see Queen and Slim. But it's gonna be real late, y'all. So I'm gonna give y'all like a little B roll. It's not gonna be too much, cause you know what I'm saying? I keep my private life private, baby. But I just got off of work. I did not film this morning. And I'm about to slip some pants on. I already got on a bodysuit, but baby, your girl ain't got no bottoms on. So it was kind of chilly this morning, y'all. Oh, let me tell y'all. I'm sorry, I'll be talking about it there. I'm gonna input some clips in this video. This morning, I got up at 5 o'clock in the morning, y'all. I went and did a 6 a.m. two-mile walk at the Westin. They had an event there. And then afterwards, we did a Starbucks coffee um, tasting. And your girl actually won the contest or the giveaway, whatever, that they had. So I got like a coffee, a Starbucks coffee, whatever. I'll show y'all later. But, yeah, I'm going to input them clips um, while I'm talking right now. And then y'all going to see that. But yeah let's slip something on we're gonna get dressed dressed later let's get to it ah, I'm excited. Ah! <laughs> all right y'all before i leave out let me show y'all real quick the coffee that i was talking about boom so this is one of their newer coffees it's a medium roast i don't know how to pronounce it kasi silo we did a taste test and it was pretty good, but they was just drinking theirs like a shot. I don't drink coffee like that. I need cream over mine. So I gotta figure out a way. If y'all know, let me know a way because this is grounded, right? And I got a Keurig, but my Keurig is only with the pods. So how the hell can I? <laughs> I asked the lady, I'm like, how can I? use it if i got a carrot you can't put ground coffee in the carrot and i'm not about to buy no old school ass um coffee thing just to brew that coffee so anyway we got to leave out i see you on the call for real y'all i look crazy i was laughing because <laughs> i'm laughing because i was really debating on whether or not i should put lotion on my feet because technically I'm about to go get my feet done anyway. So wouldn't that be stupid? But then I'm like, then they gonna see my feet. They gonna be like, damn girl, your feet ashy. But at the same time, y'all about to do my feet anyway. So I went with go ashy. So my feet are ashy and that's fine. I'm not worried about it. But I'm really trying to think now what I wanna wear because I thought I had an idea. But now I come outside, it's hot. This morning it was kind of chilly. So I'm like, okay. I can kind of do something chill, probably some jeans, a crop top, 
some sneakers. Now I'm deciding to possibly do shorts because it's hot. I don't even know how I want to get my nails, y'all. I don't be knowing what I want. Go, bitch. I don't be knowing what I want until I get there because I don't be doing like all the extra stuff. But I really had liked this set. But I think about, I'm thinking I want to do this set again, y'all. But I think instead of doing pink on the tips, because you can't really, you couldn't really tell that I needed to feel, right? Y'all, it's hot. I'm sorry. I be trying to like turn the AC off for y'all while I'm talking so that the wind is not blowing. But anyway, I'm going to finish up now because I talk too damn much anyway. But I'm thinking about getting black on the tips. I don't know. Or white, like regular French tip. Because I really like this. Um, it, was, it was giving classy. And plus, I was able to get away with the fact that I, I needed a feel. So, yeah. We shall see when I get there. But definitely doing white on the toes. It be seeming so crazy, like, when you get your feet done and you get the same color, keep getting white. It's like, it don't need like you really got your feet done. <laughs> Down, yes. Please. Yeah. <laughs> you got that nail. Mm. <laughs> for him. For him. Yeah, he's getting in America. Yeah. What's up, y'all? I just got back in the house, and I'm kind of irritated because. But first of all, my nails is cute, okay? Just a French tip and I actually got the shape changed to coffin, which these took so long for her to do, but yeah, I like my nails, but I do not like my toes. I'm used to my toe. First of all, the shape of my toe is kind of like you can, you know what, I've never had to say how I want my toes filed, like never, so. When she said, how do you want them cut and foul? First of all, she didn't cut them the first time. She tried to have them square. I don't like square toes. I like it like square with kind of round on the front, right? Square around, I guess. So the lady had to do my toes twice before another person came over there. So she's like, you want me to cut them down some more? I'm like, yeah. I like them like, you know, square around. She's like, oh, really? I never noticed somebody uh, do their toes like that. Do you always do that? I'm like, yeah, I do that every time. Do you know this lady made my toes oval? <laughs> Let me show y'all. I'm going to get in the shower real quick. I'm not even going to be mad about it because it is what it is. It's just toes. I didn't say oval. I said square around. And once you done already took the sides off, it ain't nothing you can do. You can't fix that. Can y'all tell? Do y'all see how it's like oval? Like, why they oval? Like, <laughs> they don't look that bad, but it's like, I didn't ask for this shape, bro. Like, what is this? I don't know. But anyway, this is how they look. All right, y'all. So this is the outfit, movie outfit. White crop top. I got this shirt from Forever 21, and it has something on the back. Got my fuck off socks on with my Vans, some black leggings, and I don't know what bag I'm gonna wear yet, but I'm not bringing my camera. I will record on my phone some B-roll at the movie. I will record um, on my phone. I'm not bringing my camera with me, so I'll get some footage B-roll on my phone. Hopefully it's not too dark, cause now it's dark outside, so. I will let y'all know how I work. I will check in with y'all either later on tonight when I get back, or I'm just gonna actually extend this vlog out to the weekend, y'all, because this was not long enough. <laughs> so, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and extend it out for the weekend. So, catch up with y'all on the flip side. Peace. Good morning, y'all. Welcome to another day of the vlog. Okay, let me give y'all a quick, quick update. So, I just got some gas. Um, I'm not taking my shades off because my face, well, I don't care. Like, is they completely flat now y'all but the scarring it's just uh, anyway i did not vlog this weekend today is sunday i actually wanted to drop the vlog today but i didn't vlog <laughs> so i ain't want to just give y'all like a shitty ass vlog just of me getting my nails done my feet done what else did i do that i last remember 
and going to the movies. Like that's not that's not interesting enough for me. So I was like, let me extend the vlog out, but just gonna have to post it probably on Tuesday, cause. Yeah, I think I'm going to do Tuesday. So let me give y'all a quick update. So yesterday I didn't do shit. Saturday, surprisingly, I didn't do nothing on Saturday. Like crazy, right? I stayed my ass in the house. I started to watch Hocus Pocus 2. I did not finish it. It was decent for what I saw, but obviously it didn't keep my attention enough to not finish it. I mean to finish it. I started scrolling on my phone and stuff. Like when I was watching that Jeffrey Dahmer series, y'all, I was like glued in. That's how I know if I really like something or something really interests me. So I didn't do nothing yesterday, but I did hang out Friday night, but I didn't vlog that because I didn't have anything vlogged earlier that day. So it just would have been like just inserting a clip, you know what I'm saying? But I could insert it now because it's more footage now. We went to the basement. I didn't even know the basement was a part of the James Harden restaurant, which is where I went at back in April. So I went to the restaurant part. But Friday, we stepped inside the hookah part. That hookah part, y'all, was lit. But the hookah part closed at 12. The basement is literally in the basement, but that's the name of the club, the basement. It was cool. Like, I'm not going to lie. It was lit in there. Like, they was buying bottles after bottles after bottles after bottles after bottles after bottles, right? The music was decent, just like everywhere else. But for me, I don't like the too clubby scene. Like, I like to be able to, like, I don't know. Like, camp is not too clubby to me. Camp gives me loungy, but it just gets lit. The basement was literally a club, which I don't really care for. That's, that's the vibes that happen on Friday. Then we attempted to go to the after hours club we went there called onyx we got there like 2 40 in the morning they closed at five y'all it was not given maybe we was there too early but we just went home after that so it was like nothing to really show y'all for real so that's the update but today ah today is sunday first of all y'all it's cold as shit like i walked outside today with some shorts on and a t-shirt and baby it is cold yo it's 59 degrees y'all so today Oh, it's going to be 80 later, but it's cold right now. So I wanted to run a Target real quick because I'm probably going to wear jeans today since it is kind of chilly. I don't know, but I did want to go on Target to see if I can find something kind of chill but cute because y'all, my closet is just trash. And then I'm going to Taste Bar, Taste Bar Kitchen. I'm um, going to brunch. So yeah, that's the plans for today. And then... I think that's it. I got to fold clothes when I get home later, so. I will chat with y'all, I guess, when we get to Target. See if I can find anything. So, yeah. I'm laughing at this girl that I follow that live here um, on Instagram. <laughs> Somebody posted, you definitely know you in a section with the scammers when they keep ordering all these bottles of, um, you know, alcohol and it's only five of y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Six bottles of alcohol in this five of y'all. Yeah, you're definitely with some scammers. Somebody's trying to show off. I don't know. It must have been some scammers up in the basement. Because, baby, when I tell you they was running them bottles back to back to back to back in the basement, I was like, damn. Like, y'all is out here killing it. <laughs> do your thing. I'm going to sit over here and smoke my hookah, but do your thing. <laughs> Hi, right, may I have a grande brown sugar shake and espresso? Sure, grande brown sugar, what else for you? And a large cup of ice water? And a venti ice water, anything else? No ma'am. Alright. I gotta remember that when I put on my sunglasses that it makes the screen dark. So y'all did not even just see me just now ordering my damn... <laughs> ordering my drink! I gotta pay my rent, y'all. Who in the world made us pay bills? Like, that was so ghetto. Like, who, don't, I ain't even about to rent right now. <laughs> I just don't understand this world, man. Like, y'all make people go to school when y'all don't make people, but you suggest and recommend people to go to school for all these years, get degrees and shit, to get a job, to pay back loans, and pay bills. Like, you can't even enjoy the damn money that you making. God damn. 
Oh my gosh, I can't stand paying bills, y'all. It is so annoying. Like, why couldn't I just be placed on this earth to work? I can work. I don't mind working. I can do work. As long as it's some work that I enjoy and I'm passionate about. Like, if I was just a straight full-time YouTuber, which guys will, one day I'll be able to completely rely on just, you know, that. But if I could just be a full-time YouTuber, y'all, just live my fucking life and record it like that's it i think i'm interesting enough to where people would actually like it you know like me going on trips trying food just vlogging you know what i'm saying but my man is paying the bills but the money that i'm getting is contributing to the household but he paying the major bills and we living the life and he on vacation with me y'all ain't like he ain't coming with me that is just like the perfect life, right? <laughs> happy wife, happy life. I don't believe in that, but I feel like both people should be happy. Forget it. Yeah, How you doing? Would you like straws? Um, yes, please. Thank you. Thank you. She ain't say you welcome. She ain't speak back. I say, hey, how you doing, lady? Don't be rude, bitch. <laughs> Cause I would never speak again. <laughs> so we are in here. And let's see what we can find. I'm not gonna do a whole lot of talking. I'm gonna just show y'all if I find something. And if I don't, then I don't. I'm used to the carts that got the, um, you know, the holder for the drinks. Mm. Look how big this dress is. I didn't know this dress was this big. <laughs> I got it in a size medium, but obviously I need to go down a size. But it's not bad. But is it giving brunch? Like, think about it smaller. I don't know. Then we got this one, y'all. Which is just a plain, I don't know, this look too plain to me. I really like this. This don't give brunch. Y'all, this one look like a nightgown. <laughs> and it's big as hell. This is a medium as well. So I'm thinking like, if it was giving more like hoochie a little bit, <laughs> <laughs> It'd be cuter if it was tighter, but this look like I'm gonna go to sleep. But I still don't think satin is brunch vibes. Okay, y'all, I'm back at the crib. So I ended up getting the green dress in a size extra small. Small. I was gonna get an extra small, but I was like, I don't want where you know how even when you button and they got like the little space in between. I ain't want that. So I also found these little shorts. And these are actually pajama shorts, but I feel like I got a white bodysuit that I haven't worn yet that I think would kind of look cute. I don't know. I'm going to just see. Got me some witch hazel wipes because I ran out this morning. And y'all, I just cleaned this out, but I got this little coffee thing for like, I think it was $3 in a little discount section. So I think it's going to be cute to like put my coffee in. I need to stop buying Starbucks coffee, y'all because I already got coffee at the house, but it's just like something about the Starbucks coffee that just hit different. So I'm about to put some coffee in here now. I just cleaned it, y'all, hold on. Hold on, wait a minute. Let me put some pimmin in it. So this is the coffee that I have, which is STOK Cold Brew. This is black, bold, and smooth, and then dairy-free almond milk. Um, creamer, vanilla. All right, y'all, I'm gonna get in the shower. I'm thinking about should I wash my face before or after I get out of the shower? I think I'm gonna do after. So, um, I'm gonna do like the, I don't know if I showed y'all before, I think I did. 
the um, turmeric and sugar scrub or something like turmeric and something scrub that I got from Etsy black owned mm. I use it on my bikini area but I'm a I use it on my face too I haven't used it on my face in a while but it's going to clear up these dark spots the pimples are gone but hopefully they don't know come back so I'm gonna just get in the shower first and then um, I'm gonna wash my face when I get out Oh, and by the way, I'm not wearing the dress. I'm not wearing a green dress. The material of the dress is just a little thin. You know what I'm saying? So, like, you know, things be moving when I walk. So, <laughs> I'm not being funny. I'm so serious. But I don't want all the movement. Like, I need things to be still, you know? So, yeah, I, I don't, I don't want to do the dress. The dress, I think, is too thin. But I do, those shorts I showed y'all, I do like it with the white bodysuit. And, um, yeah, I'm going to throw that on. So this is the scrub that I was telling y'all about. Um, I'm going to just wash my, ooh, wash my face with this. I might start using this again for, like, at least two weeks to get my skin color back. You know what I'm saying? Get rid of the dark spots. And plus it's good for your skin anyway. But I was trying to see if I had some gloves because my nails got white tip. This will make your fingernails orange. So, uh. Dang, I ain't got shit I can grab this with. Ah. I think I'm going to get a spoon. Hold on. So I got a spoon from the kitchen. Because I'm not trying to get my nails messed up, y'all. I mean, it come off, but it's like you got to do too much, y'all. You got to wet your face first. And it is an exfoliator, so I needed to exfoliate my face anyway. Okay, we're going to wet it a little bit so it can kind of like, you know. It's in my hand. I actually got a lot more than I need, honestly. I don't need that much, but woo. Mm. I want to really get right there because that's where the dark spots are. Woo! This is why I love these little things because I can clean that, but I'd rather it get there than in my damn hair. Oh! The more you use it, the brighter it's going to make your skin. I need to start using it under my underarms. Because, y'all, my underarms is so dark for my complexion. And I know it's because I'm shaving. I want to eventually start getting wax under my underarms, too. But I haven't, I haven't gotten that yet. But I just might start because I don't like how dark my armpits are. So if y'all know some solutions, again, I might use this, but if you know anything else, let me know. So just to make sure that it's completely off, I'm going to also go in with my Witch Hazel Wipes, which I love, 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 love. They need to get a, the big one. I need to get like a big pack because these go so fast, y'all. Watch when I show y'all. Y'all want to see what I'm talking about, how it didn't come all the way off. Look at that. You see how it's still yellow? That's that. And then use my fat water. I guess it's like a little mini skincare routine, I guess. Uh, Fenty Skin Fat Water. This is a toner. I put too much. You don't even need that much, honestly. Because a little goes a long way. Let me fix my towel, y'all. Because <gasps> the goodies was trying to pop out, okay? Oh, my skin feel good. It's so soft. Mmm, so soft. And then I use lotion on my face, y'all. This is, I feel like I told y'all a hundred times. <laughs> this is the lotion that I use. This is Nivea um, Deep Nourishing Serum and Almond Oil Dry to Very Dry Skin. You do not need a lot for your face. Literally just, that's how much I use. I don't use a lot at all, y'all, because it spread really good. And plus, I use that, um, what's it called? Black Girl Sunscreen, which is also 
kind of oily so and then i use black girl sunscreen they say you're supposed to do like two fingers or some shit i don't know i don't really use that much because that lotion give me hydration and step y'all i use either this one or this one is mario Badusco skin care spray uh, this one has aloe herbs and rose water and then this one has uh, excuse me aloe cucumber and green tea i think i'm gonna use this one i haven't i used it i've been using this one a lot lately so let's use this one Woo! that is my skincare as y'all can see the dark spots is still there obviously but they would lighten up and give me like a week of using this I will link this in the description box below. I got this from Etsy, black owned brand, Sugar Rose Company. So yeah, I'ma chill out for a little bit, lotion my rest of my body and get myself together. And I'll check in with y'all in a minute. The girl is dressed and ready to go to brunch. Oh, FYI, Taste Bar, we found out it shut down, which we did not know. So we're going to Chapman and Kirby's, which I've never been there before. So I'm excited. Um, I got my hair tied back today. Let me show y'all my outfit. See if y'all can see it over there. <laughs> so this is the white shirt I was telling y'all about that I got from Aritzia. If y'all seen that haul, y'all would know. These are some night shorts. $5, y'all. This green bag I thought was cute with it and these nude shoes. So, your girl's out the door. I will log on my phone. Y'all already know, and this is a date, so <laughs> I won't be logging too much, but I'm gonna try to get some back B-roll or behind the scenes of the place when we get there, so peace. What's up, y'all? Your girl is back home. I just got in the shower. Sorry if this vlog is all over the place, y'all. Forgive me. I was doing a lot, trying to show little clips here and there because I was trying to go out and do things that, you know, I wasn't really trying to post about because it's my personal private life, but I still want to give y'all a little insight. So anyway, if you like the video still, give me a thumbs up. If you do not like the video, give me a thumbs up. I appreciate y'all for clicking on that video. And I will see you guys in my next vlog. Peace.